गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वी विल कंटिन्यू विद द चैप्टर लॉगरिदम एंड हेयर वी विल नो अबाउट द बेस चेंजिंग फॉर्मूला एंड हाउ टू यूज दिस टू सॉल्व सम ऑफ द क्वेश्चन ऑफ लॉगरिदम ऑफ एक्सरसाइज नाइन पॉइंट टू सो वी हैव द फॉर्मूला हेयर द बेस इज ए लॉग बेस ए एम इज इक्वल टू लॉग बेस बी एम डिवाइड बाई लॉग बेस बी ए सो बेस इज चेंज फ्रॉम ए टू बी एंड दिस इज द फॉर्मूला वी हैव I repeat this formula: log base a m is equal to log base b m divided by log base b a. And for this, for this formula, we have some of the conditions, like m a and b are greater than zero, and this a and b not equal to one. So, with those conditions, we have the formula. Now, from this formula, from this formula, we have. Like uh, here we have log base b m, so this log base b m can be written as the product of those two terms. Okay, cross multiplication is done here. So this log base b m, this log base b m is equal to this log base a m, log base a m into log base b a. Okay, so this is the formula. Now suppose that we replace this b as ten. So we have here this b as ten. Lo log Uh, log base ten m is equal to log a m log base a m into log ten a. So you know that if the base is ten, then we can write like this: log m is equal to log base a m into log a. Okay. So this is the formula that we can learn. We can remember easily. Okay. Log m equals to the product of two terms with a changed base. Here log m equal to log a m log base a m log base a m into log a. So where bases are not put, that means base is ten here and base is ten here. Here here we have the same formula. So how to use those formula? We have one example. See, the example is log ten log base ten two can be written as if we want to change the base with twenty seven. So it will be log base twenty seven two into log ten twenty seven. Okay, log base twenty seven. Directly we can write if we if we want want to put this ten as base as base. So we can write log two is equal to log base whatever we whatever the base we want to put here. And uh, suppose that twenty seven is here. So log log base twenty seven two into log twenty seven. Okay, the base remains as ten. Now. See the next example we have log three can be written as if we want to change the base as four so it will be log four log base four three into log four okay so where bases are not put that means base is ten see now we will solve one of the question of exercise nine point two here that is question number twenty one we will start with the LHS part of this question twenty one bit a so we have log sorry three to the power log four. Okay, so log four is present here, so that means log base ten four. So for this, for this we can write log three, log base three four. See and into log three. We we are using this formula. See, we are using actually this formula. Log m equals to log base a m into log a. So here we have log four. So we can write log base three four. Into log three, okay, simple. Now, why we did it? This is only because previously we have visit a formula. See, uh, we have the formula. Let me show you the formula first. See, this one is the formula. It is written here. If we have a to the power log base a x, then it will be x. Okay. So, for I mean uh, to convert. This order to get this order we have we have done with the log four as a log base three four into log three. So this is the idea to take here base three. Okay. So now for this part only see it is written inside the bracket. For this part log base three four can be written as four. See. Okay. Log a base a log base a x equal to x. So here we have three log base three four. Can be written as four, so it will be log, I mean four 
to the power log 3 and which is actually the RHS of this given question. So this is proved. So this is the solution. Now we have this as the formula. Okay. Log base B M is equal to log base A. The base is changed as A log base a m into log base b a okay so if you put m equals to b so it will be log base b see this one second this for this m we will put b for this m we will put b so log base b b okay base is same log base b b so here we have log a i mean log base a b into log base b a and this is equal to 1 this is only because this part is 1 okay so this one is 1 now this is the this is very important formula uh, log base b a is equal to 1 by log base a b okay just we have interchanged the uh, the places of a and b and take the reciprocal okay so this is the formula very important formula that we are going to use here so let's take some of the example suppose we have this log base x a then these two x and a are interchanged so it will be taken as reciprocal 1 by log base a x okay here we have log a b c log base a b c a so it will be 1 by log base a a b c okay so based on this we have some of the questions to solve see here we have 1 by log base to 42 so it can be written as by uh, taking the reciprocal we can write log base 42 2 okay so for the other terms we can write like log base that means all the logs with the same base 42 so we can use the product formula product law so it will be log base 42 into 2 into because the terms are added okay logarithmic forms are added so we will use the product law so uh, it will be 2 into 3 into 7 which is equal to 42 so log 42 log base 42 42 is equal to 1 and this is the RHS that we have to prove now go to the next question question number 28 bit 1 is solved bit 2 you can solve now for question number 29 bit 1 is same as the previously solved question like this okay so we will go we will go to bit 2 of question number 29 here we have see log base b a into log base c b into log base d c is equal to rhs is given and what we have to prove you can see in your book okay now we are using a formula here this okay if we have log base b m then we can write log base a into a m into log base b a okay see this base and this part both are same okay both are same so here we were we were using the formula see uh, log this log b base log base b a into log base c b so this b and b same so we can write this part the underlined part as a, this okay so it will be log base c a now for those two terms we have the c base here and c is here so we can write directly log base d log base d a okay log base d a and this is actually the rhs part of the question so it is proved now go to the next question question number 30 hint is given and you should try to solve question number 30 by your own so question number 31 bit 2 is solved here so by seeing this solution you can solve the bit 1 we have here log 2x plus log 8x plus log 32x see the bases are not same so that's why we have taken the base changing formula and we have take the bases as x so we have written here that 1 by log base x2 1 by log base x8 and 1 by log base x32 so for this 8 and 32 we can use 2 to the power 3 and 2 to the power 5 now we can write here see it is written here we have the RHS part like this okay 23 by 15 so see power power law is used here the power law is used for those two so it can be 3 log x log base 
x2 and here 5 log base x2 so that means we can take out log base x2 as common so that is we have taken 1 by log base x2 is taken as common so here we have 1 and here we have 1 by 3 and here we have 1 by 5 so when those are added see what we have okay so uh, if we go further then this part is cancelled okay so what left in the RHS it is only 1 so for this 1 by log x log base x2 we can write see this log base x2 is, is a log 2 x so for this log 2 x we have visited the formula initially that if we have log base 2 x then we can write log whatever the base we want to take suppose that we want to take 10 10 as base so log 10 see this log 10 x here log base 10 2 okay this is the first formula that we have started with so this uh, log uh, 1 by log x log base x2 can be written here like that okay because this is it is completely explained so this uh, after cross multiplication this log x equal to log 2 so that means this x equal to 2 and this is the final answer so thank you class